All right, we're back. Friday Night Lights basketball style. A ton of high school basketball games tonight as teams position themselves for the postseason, which is coming up in less than two weeks. Okay, we start with Germantown and Madison Central senior night for the Jaguars, but it was the Mavericks who start off red hot from the floor. Kelsey Pearson gets in the middle, gets the first bucket of the game with a floater. Well, Mavs with the lead, but MC coming right back. They match that bucket with the Caleb Kent stop and pop for two. But uh, Germantown won a bit of a run to start the game. Here is C.J. Ferguson with the three ball off a Peterson assist. But Madison Central, they will rally and they would win it 61 to 49. All right, go to some girls action. Pearl and Northwest Rankin clash tonight. Cougars with the lead in the second half. Zamaya Brown off the handoff. She will extend that lead. She turns the corner and hits Slayer for two. Pearl still hanging in there, though, thanks to this steal from Alexandria Villanueva. She goes coast to coast, stops and pops for two at the free throw line. Pearl goes on a little bit of a, one, a, little bit of a run. Lexis Keys trying to end it. She gets the ball in the fast break. Nice Euro step move there. She gets the deuce, but it was Pearl who would come out on top in a close one. 45 to 44, the Pirates win. And the boys, the boys teams, they scored off tonight as well. The Cougar fans were happy in this one. Uh, late in the game, NWR was slamming everything, specifically LeBeyond Lindsay on the run out, dunks that one home to extend the lead to double digits for the Cougs. Northwest rankings Kobe Bilbro sees that dunk, raises it by a point with this triple from the corner. Bilbro caught fire towards the end. He's going to hit another three ball in the opposite corner. Northwest ranking goes on a run to end the game. The Cougars and Pearl split the matchup tonight. NWR boys, they win it 79 to 56. All right, some MAIS action. First place, Jackson Prep Girls team taking on MRA. MRA in comeback mode down the stretch. They trail by double digits seconds in the second half. Allison Redding able to hit inside. Later, MRA saves a loose ball. And Ella Wesley Davis makes the most of it with the jumper, but too much from MRA. Andy Flatgard let everyone with 11 points. She gets an assist here, finding open Julia Stradinger, who finishes. Prep wins 37 to 20. They remain in first place in the 6A standings. And the nightcap, one versus number two matchup in the boys' game, MRA versus Prep. And uh, Harrison Alexander gets the game started with a nice turnaround jumper to get this one going. Then his teammate, Joshua Hubbard, one of the best guards in the state, showing his post moves, a nice up and under move to get the bucket. It was tight early on, but Prep went on a run. Check out Luke Segris getting to the rack, getting the roll for the bucket. Prep is up on top. Cam Brent driving, scoring, and and winning. He was fired up. The Patriots led by 13 in the second quarter, and Prep hands MRA their first conference loss of the season, 38-34 the final. And we'll be back after this.